choice, which is going to be the Fort Moultrie. Yes, Fort Moultrie. Uh, this is where the Star Trek is. That's, that's in Charleston, in Fort, okay. Fort Moultrie, as you can see right there. Also known, that's the actual name of the fort. You have Fort Moultrie, Fort Sumner uh, that are out there. And so that is the that is the famous, uh, uh, famous battle there. This is the last of 2016. I've only got 95 of these. Once again, at my original issue price that you see there, the original issue price on those only $99.95, or uh, $199.95. Every coin, remember, five pure ounces of silver I mean, on top of rarity, unlike anything that you've seen out there. They're just uh, so impressive. They're amazing. Now, it, continue to call in on the Fort Moultrie. We'll leave that available. I think there was only like 80 left. There is less, about, just about seven left in the Volcanoes oh, Park right. Quarter, so the Hawaiian. Five ounces. Now, all of these come out of original government boxes. All of these come out of original government boxes, which means they are gem, brilliant, uncirculated, absolutely, positively perfect, perfect, perfect for collectors. Folks, absolutely amazing opportunities. Buy your five ounce American, uh, uh, American, America the Beautifuls. It is something that is just, I'm, I'm telling you, it is the most overlooked collectible that the United States government has released today. Wow, so we have them available. Continue to call in on all the choices. We will keep you updated when that Hawaiian one sells out. But we are going to move right into our last 30 years of the Indian head sense from 1880 to 1909. Now, I said to Mike, um, I said, I thought we were gonna have more of these. Yeah. And he was just like, yeah, nice try, Robin. There are only 204 of these to go around, so this is extremely limited. This is nearly 30 years of the Indian head sense for $199.95, free shipping. The last time mm -hmm. I aired this with you, we did not have free shipping. Mm -hmm. So I'm loving that once you spend $75 or more, free shipping on everything. And you also have the four flexible payments of $49.99. Now, Mike, I know you're gonna break down the value on this. Uh, and I absolutely will. And you said it's nearly 30 years. I have to point out it's exactly oh. Oh, 30 okay. years. Okay, sorry. Because, <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, it's important that people get, know that it they is. get 30 it coins. Is. And not only do they get 30 coins, they get the last 30 years of Indian head sense and I know the way the the lights are it's kind of difficult to see right. yeah is what they are I want to pull this out so that you can see that's an 1880 Indian head sense there's a great shot right there look at this coin these are 100% original Indian head sense check that out this one is from 1880 so you get 1880 through 1909 now, the little uh, uh, plastic that you see on there, this is always, and, and like I said, with two, uh, usually I sell out 500 sets of these. I only have the 200. That's why we're only gonna do uh, about, uh, you know, four or, five, uh, four or five minutes here uh, is, what we're, is what we're gonna do on these. So we have 1880, 81, all the way through 1909. Now, let me bottom line this. Of course, you get the last 30 years of Indian head sets. That's all good and well and, 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 and all of that. However, <laughs> however, they're all gonna be very good to find condition, and it's the price. So at $199, let's do the math. Now you understand the, the, uh, uh, the airtight holders are 59 cents, the box is about uh, uh, $10, so you're gonna have 15, you got about $25 in there, so I'm gonna call it about 20, so that, let's call it $20, so you have about $6 a coin. So you're paying about $6 a coin. In the nationally advertised catalog, the 1909 Indian, if you may remember, the 1909 was the very first year that the, in, that the Lincoln cent came out. So they mostly made Lincoln cents. So when you see this coin, the 1909 Indian, that's why this coin individually is $40.50. Okay, it's $40.50. What do you say we're paying $6 a coin? You're paying $6. Right. You're paying $6. And at 1880, I'm gonna go up Even here. I, I have, can figure that out. Yeah, I have the nationally advertised catalog. Instead of $6, I got $18, $21, $17.95, $14, $18, $31.50, $36.50. $36 I mean, when you look at these coins, we're $6 a piece. You, what you don't see, generally speaking, is the 1885 and the 1893. The 1893, extraordinarily, uh, or 1894, sorry.
sorry, is the extraordinarily difficult coin. That's why people do the last 10 years on a regular basis. So these last 10 years are done on a regular basis. But the first 10 years are almost never done because the rarity in United States coin collecting is exceptional. These are not reprinted or restruck or redone in any way, shape, or form. The other great thing about Indian Head since is they were, until 1908, only made at the Philadelphia Mint. So this is what also accounts for a complete collection of Indian Head cents as well, other than the uh, 2008 uh, and 2009 estimated coins, which are thousands of, uh, thousands of dollars is what they have. But we have these coins here on a coin by coin by coin by coin basis. You're looking at not 199 or even 299, but closer to 399 or even more. As a matter of fact, I have $375 from the ones I could find. Right. Now, of course, the ones that they didn't find were the rarest ones of the bunch, so I can easily call this $400 on a, right. if purchased separately. <laughs> The key to this is getting them. Like you said, why don't you have more? Because, I mean, you know, why, why don't you have, because we usually have 300, 400, 500, or 600. If you can see right now, we have about 45 seconds left. I've only got about 180 sets left. I've only got about 180 of these sets left. Every one of these coins, not reprinted, restruck, or redone. I'm going to pull this coin right here. Look at this coin. Let's see if we can get in as close as we can on that. Look at that. You know, I have to say, collectors love 1883. to collect 1883. Yeah. It is the most uh, iconic American coin. You can show anybody this coin anywhere, and they will know, oh, that's an American coin right there. Look at that. 1883, 100% original. Every coin in the entire set looks okay. like that. It is spectacular. So free shipping and uh, four flex yeah, of 49.99. is your item number. Continue to call in there. We'll let you know when those are gone. We also want to update you. The Volcanoes Park quarter has completely sold out. Thank you for your orders Now, there. remember, that was 529. Right. If you want to buy a coin that is just as rare, the, the Ozark, Ozark Riverways is just as rare. I'm going to do my level best not to knock over Mike. this set. Yes, I know you do. <laughs> I did listen. Okay. We only have 36 of the Ozarks uh, left. Oh, and that's okay. my very, very, very Wait, last quantity at 219. Remember, we had 140 of those. And Mike, you said the rarity in that was they only made 20,000. Same as the Hawaii. That's why right. the Hawaii is so 500 bucks. So can you bucks. put in perspective for me, like, what would be the average release on the five ounces? Uh, about like, 60,000. Oh, okay. So 20,000 or 60,000. That's minuscule. Even 60000 isn't a lot That's when you think deal. about it. It is a big deal. Okay, speaking of big deal, we <laughs> have some, Allison, what are we, well over 400 now? Have already been spoken for, 400 spoken for of the U.S. Mint 20, 225th anniversary set of the Denver release. Now, this is a limited edition of 936. We've already sold 400, so that <laughs> is 50, almost 50% 50 of our quantity that we have for today this is brand no, no, no. that we have forever. forever right sorry no i like the technicality <laughs> yeah well, it's a, for me that's important it because is, i mean i have 936 sets well and you can't do first day of issue precisely once it's marked and designated first day of issue we can't add to it so mm -hmm. it is what it is there say la vie once it's gone now at 349.95 we have free shipping and handling you're going to get all 10 coins they're individually slabbed they're also individually perfect 70s enhanced and circulated which mike that's really difficult to get every coin to grade <laughs> 70. Because there's always a, a, a laggard. <laughs> there's right. always one, and there was one in it's this. It's like that one child. It no, was I'm actually, just yeah, that's right. <laughs> I'm kidding. It's, and for this one, it was the nickel. In all honesty, the nickel is the, is the deciding factor here. The nickel is the one that is the, by far and away the most difficult to get. It's just, there's just, it just doesn't grade well. So let me explain to you what this is. The United States government just released this special enhanced uncirculated set. They did, for the 225th anniversary of the United States Mint, they did 225,000 sets. They sold out on the United States Mint, Mint website in about three and a half minutes, okay? In about three and a half minutes. And if you looked out there in some of these electronic uh, auction site things, price doubled just like that. Mm -hmm. That's the regular 200, that's the regular set. And there's a reason for that. The United States government has never done an enhanced uncirculated set of coins before. As a matter of fact, they had only done six or, uh, I'm sorry, there's nine, my mistake, because I forgot about the presidential. Nine enhanced uncirculated dollars or coins ever before. 
So we doubled the number of coins. And while they would do one coin in a set in Enhanced Uncirculated, because they were so special, they had never done an entire set of coins in this special Enhanced Uncirculated. And people ask me, what does Enhanced Uncirculated mean? And why is it so limited? The biggest reason for that is the United States government has to laser finish the dies. That's the Enhanced Uncirculated part. So they literally polish the dies with lasers before they strike the coin. Mm. And so that's what creates this look. That's what creates this feel. That's what creates this desirability in the limited edition. So you have this Enhanced Uncirculated set that was just released, okay? It was just released. Now what we've got is we've got the entire set out there. The sets themselves, difficult to get, like I said, sold out from the United States Mint in about three to four minutes. But we have got them certified. Now remember, just the certification process alone is normally a $30, uh, a $30 purchase just to certify that's not guaranteed 70 that's just to certify so you're going to get 10 of these enhanced uncirculated certified coins and then the red oak presentation box there's your 349 right but now let's talk about the rarity of the coins because of this enhanced uncirculated over 400 of these are gone if we may the lincoln scent that you see right here because of the way that it's made with this special finish this in special enhanced uncirculated this is the rarest San Francisco minted scent ever made by the United States government. That includes the 1909 SVDB. It includes <clears throat> all of the rarities, 31, uh, 31S. Everything that you see out there, this coin is rarer than all of them. As a matter of fact, if you uh, take out the proof coins, the special issue matte proof coins from 100 years ago, this is the rarest Lincoln scent, period. So when you look at getting that coin for basically, <clears throat> excuse me, $30, I think now you begin to understand rarity, collectability, and desirability. It's the only enhanced uncirculated, the special finish that's ever been done on any Lincoln scent. And then it's the rarest and all of those things that make it so rare and so desirable and so collectible. Then you go right next door and you look at the, uh, uh, and you look at the nickel. And you look at that Jefferson nickel that you see right there. That is the only enhanced uncirculated Jefferson nickel. And it has this matte finish, this beautiful matte finish that is on this coin that is unlike any nickel that's ever been done. And it is by far and away the rarest nickel ever made by the United States government since the, the, the early issue proof yeah. coins. It obviously. almost looks like it's stippled. Like yes, because the die has been laser finished. Let me flip that over on the reverse with that and try not to uh, dump these on the ground, okay? So as you can see right there, it gives you, you that, that last incredible, hour. <laughs> yeah, you missed that last hour. I dumped the whole thing, uh, the whole set on the floor. Uh, and there's still 70. That's why you buy certified coins. Right. Same thing with the dime. You got the half dollar. I think the quarters are going to be the key to the set. They have only done, those are the five rarest Washington quarters ever made by the United States Mint. It's not even close. You're looking at the five rarest quarters. They're all done in enhanced uncirculated. They're the only enhanced uncirculated coins ever made by the United States government in the quarter series. So now you put all those things together that the coins are phenomenally rare. Now understand, of course, that they're graded and certified absolutely positively perfect. So they're EU 70s. So remember, the higher the grade, the more it's worth. So these are absolutely perfect. So you start with a coin that's phenomenally rare and difficult to get to start with. In other words, uh, uh, an enhanced uncirculated coin, a set that's sold out from the United States government. Now, of course, to certify the entire set of 10 coins, that's why you see these sets out there. If you see them, they're $4.99, they're $5.99, perhaps even $699 that are out there. So we have gotten them at $349 in the Red Oak presentation box. That's a price that you basically are just not going to find, particularly with that Red Oak presentation box. Over 425 sets. So we are perilously close to halfway sold out. Mm -hmm. This is right here. This is our initial presentation. It's the very first uh, time. Normally you have like show. the 2 a.m. to be able to right. share it first. So, I mean, this is everyone's getting to see it for the first time. And the fact that we are offering it on free shipping. So Ooh. coins typically do not have free shipping and handling. So this is the perfect day to shop for this set. You're getting that free shipping and handling as well. You're getting the Red Oak presentation box. You're getting something that's rare, that is really 
a lot of enthusiasm and excitement about this set. Each one of them graded that perfect 70. So, you know, Mike, for someone who is new, that perfect 70, a lot of us think if we're new to coins, like it should be 100, but 70 is the scale, 70 right? is the highest grade that we have. Okay. So, I mean, you know, in coins, we're going on a 70-point scale. There's no E100 or, or, uh, <laughs> right. or MS100 or, or no 71 even or 70.1. 70 is the highest. Mm -hmm. So now let's let's go back and, and look at this. We're, we're just about to go 436, which means that we have less than 500 sets remaining. So first of all, this set, of course, uh, in the special label that you have here is exclusive to us. Mm -hmm. Now, I want to talk about that label for a second because it's very important for collectors. This set in terms of its live release, was first released in Denver at the American Numismatic Association show, the ANA show in Denver. Okay, these coins are the Denver coins. As you can see, the Denver release, August 1st. That's the key to the coins you're getting here. That's the special label, that you're getting the special ANA label. And that's critically important to the collectability of these. You may see some other labels or something out there, but not the ANA label. That is, as you can see, the Annex Denver release label is exclusive to us here at uh, HSN. There's no doubt about that. So the label is of critical importance. Then you have the fact that they're certified perfect. The fact that you get all 10 coins. The fact that they come in the Red Oak presentation box. And then when you break them down, and here's ultimately what it comes down to. When you break it down coin by coin by coin, right. that is your key consideration. That's the key value to my mind right here is the fact when you break these down. When you look at the rarest Lincoln cent, what should that sell for? in absolutely perfect condition. Well, I can tell you, after we sell this set out, and we will sell this set out, after we do that, we will take other sets, not these sets, mm -hmm. and I will sell the coins, in essence, individually. We will sell the subsets of these coins. Right. So in other words, I will sell the quarter sets as a quarter set. I'll sell the Kennedy individually, and the Sacagawea, I'll sell the penny. I can tell you right now, the penny I'm gonna right. sell for $59.95 or $69.95 right, all day long. but this is the best way to get the set at the best There's price. There's no possible way that I can do it for less than this. Right. So when we break it up, yeah, it's going to be way more. Right. Plus, it won't have the exclusive Denver label. Mm -hmm. It won't be numbered of 936. It won't have any of those other things that are, uh, uh, that are out there. So that is of crucial importance to you. Now, here's the other thing that's of kind of critical and crucial importance. The fact that we've sold 452 of these. So, uh, 450, 468 is halfway. Once we sell that, and this is not available anyplace else. So, in other words, uh, you know, you can find NGC or PCGS sets maybe out there, but you're simply, absolutely, positively not going to find them at $349.95, right. particularly with the Red Oak presentation box, which we've shown right there, which is absolutely stunning. Beautiful you, solid wood uh, uh, lid, as you can see right there. I'm just going to pick it up so yeah, you yeah, can see So it. you can see right there with the piano hinge, each coin, individually, uh, each coin individually displayed that you can see right there. I, I absolutely love that. I and mean, like if I said, the lacquer a, finish. Oh my gosh. I mean, it's fine. I mean, even just look at the reflection mm -hmm. of the coins. I mean, it's just the inside is just as beautiful as the outside. You've got that mm -hmm. velvet lining on the bottom. So if you're putting this on a coffee table, uh, a coffee table, a curio cabinet, you know, it's going to look exquisite. Even those mm -hmm. piano hinges that you have, mm -hmm. this is first class all the way. So, you know, equally as important, not only the value, not only just the rarity within the coins, but how we display them, how we keep them, how we preserve them for generations to come because this is that heirloom set that you will pass down from generation to generation today is that day this is the first time you're getting to see it we invite you in toll-free call to get your order we also invite you to utilize hsn.com because we are very busy on this set that makes your ordering process that much quicker that much faster because you can jump to the head of the line and secure your order we have a limited quantity to go around it's also a limited edition that first day of issue so once it's gone we can cannot add more. Right. You Right, Mike? Because right you'll come to this exclusive label and you'll see that provenance. You'll know where it's coming from and you're going to even see where your set falls in that limited edition collection. So all of that together in totality makes this something special, rare, collectible and something sought after to really treat yourself today. Well, uh, and keep in mind, there's two two things here. There now you go. It was it's my your turn. turn. 
<laughs> you turned, like, there you go. What is save our problem today? Yeah, save, I don't know. We're throwing them all over. We're over half oh my sold out gosh. now. Now, now they did 225,000 sets sold out from the mint in, in four minutes, three to four minutes. I'm not going to touch any. They did 25,000 sets at Denver. These are one of the, and I, and I guess maybe I've not made that clear. These are one of the 25,000 Denver sets. Okay. That's why it's at the Denver release. These are Denver release sets, as you can see from August 1st, 2017. So that's why that label is of critical importance so that you get one of those 25,000 sets that was a Denver set that was released at the show that of course brought even more uh, more of that so you have another subset of rarity so that's how you get that label then you have the subset of the of the absolutely perfect yeah. then you have the rarity of the set you have the subset of the Denver set then you have it conditionally rare in EU 70 right. this is a significant numismatic set that I think is what the important thing for people to understand and Mike, I was going to ask you, do they grade right on site, site at the show? Well, Annex happens to be in Denver. Oh, right. So they grade some of them on, they graded some at of the them show. on the floor, but they have yes. to sit, the, the ceiling machine's huge. Right. I mean, you have to have this huge ceiling yeah, machine. And they impressive. do have, a, have one, but to grade this many sets, you have to understand, well, I have a thousand, I mean, they had to grade 10,000 coins in like two days. Oh my God. That's a big deal because you have the wow. tamper evident holographic seal. They're certified absolutely positively perfect. Denver release, as you can see, August 1st, 2007. And, uh, and and there was a huge line right, at to the, uh, just to even get these. Now, at could you Denver. buy them at the show? Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. These are the coins that you could buy at the yeah. show, and and that's the big thing. So now, once again, 936 in the limited edition. Yeah. We are about to be 500 sold. So we're well over halfway now. Now, this is the first day that we have offered these for sale. Now, I do want to do another quick breakdown. There's the sold, as you can see right there, 494, 495. So we're looking at 500 sets. Now, I, I want to do a very quick thing, and I know we have about a minute and a half on the clock. Maybe go over a, a half a minute or a minute or so. Because I want to I want to explain the coins kind of individually again. Okay. The United States government took a complete set of, of coins, so penny, nickel, dime, quarter, half dollar, and dollar coins. They did it in a special un enhanced on circuit that's a special uh, presentation finish that is only uh, that is only reserved for the rarest the most desirable the most collectible of all the sets that the United States government does there's no doubt about that normally they have only released that one coin at a time an entire set is basically held together by having one enhanced on circulating because right, didn't the JFK yeah that, they, they that had was one a three there was a four coin set oh, okay, four one points. enhanced on circulating right because we bought that right and absolutely there was only one that's in there. right so you right. have all these sets there's one enhanced on strictly but they now have you never get the done entire set every single solitary right. coin is enhanced on circular and now we have over 500 spoken for yep. i feel like everyone is kind of jumping on in and getting your order placed do not hesitate this is a limited edition of 936 and 500 have been sold and this is the very first airing so so last last look at this there are five the five rarest washington quarters ever made right here the five only there's been five enhanced uncirculated quarters ever made by the United States government right here that should sell for three hundred and forty nine dollars the rarest Lincoln cent right here like I said sends the early matte proof that coin could legitimately sell for a hundred the only enhanced uncirculated nickel only the second dime only the second half dollar the only clad all of these at San Francisco mint one of the largest San Francisco mint sets ever made particularly in the enhanced uncirculated right. folks with everybody on the phone I have maybe three hundred sets in the entire edition get your what did you say it was perilous what would what, you say What's that? <laughs> it was getting perilously close wait perilously <laughs> there you go to be sold out to be in peril okay there you go. perilously i was trying to get it out i couldn't get it out <laughs> uh, so do not wait on getting yours but guess whose anniversary it is it's marlo's anniversary and we're going to check it out we'll be right back Marlo Smith's 20 year anniversary and we're celebrating with special anniversary pricing and exclusive anniversary items. Join us as we walk down memory lane with Marlo from over two decades. Plus check out her hand-picked favorite items from Moncombe, Smith and Cult, and many more. Pop the champagne and show Marlo some love. The celebration begins Sunday at 5 p.m. or search Marlo Smith at hsn.com to shop all her favorites. Sharpen every knife in your kitchen with Wolfgang Puck's 3-in-1 knife and scissor sharpener. Dull is boring, not to mention hard to cut with. 
One swipe and you're sharp again. Get the perfect slice every time. Cut through tough items easily. It sharpens kitchen scissors too. Search Quick Buy on hsn.com for more. Simply Classic. Simply Essential. Simply perfect for every style. Sometimes the greatest pleasures are the simplest ones of all. Watch Concierge Collection tonight only on HSN. Meet Joy. Joy sees the world differently. And when you see the world differently, amazing things can happen. Perfect. When Joy meets hangers, hangers get slim. Clothes cuddle up. Space opens, messes vanish, and your closet becomes organized, colorful, and fun. That's right, fun. Tune in to celebrate the 20th anniversary of the Huggable Hanger with joy. Visit hsn.com keyword Huggable Hangers. Music. I haven't worked with you in a while. Yeah, that's right. Yes, huh? but as you know, I'm not good with numbers, so I can't remember how long. But I'm your host, Robin Wall. And Somewhere we're gonna... between three months and 12 years. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh, you missed it. But it's too long to tell you right now. We're going to move right into our silver dollars. And our silver dollars, this is a three-piece set. And this is from the 20th century. Now, this is a trio, so you're going to get three of them. You're going to get your Morgan, your Peace, and your American Eagle silver dollars. At $169.95, we've got free shipping and and we've got four flexible payments of $42.49. But Mike, tell us the importance of these three coins. I mean, you get... First, I mean, the United States government made three silver dollars, actually silver, silver dollars, okay. in the 20th century. So from, you know, 1900 to, to 1999. Right. They made three different silver dollars. They made a Morgan silver dollar, a Peace silver dollar, and a Silver Eagle. The uh, Silver Eagle, they still make today, but uh, the Morgan ended in uh, 1921, and the Peace dollar ended in 1935, started in 1921. I and love then the Morgan the, uh, dollars. <laughs> that's right. And then the Silver Eagle started in 1986 and continues on to this day. Now, the Silver Eagle that you get here will be prior to 2000. These are all 20th century, so these are all going to be 80s or uh, 80s or 90s uh, American silver eagles. They look incredible. Yeah, well, they're all brilliant uncirculated. That's why. <laughs> yeah, that would be that would be the reason. Is and but I think that's important. Yes. So you get a brilliant uncirculated Morgan dollar, a brilliant uncirculated Peace dollar, and a brilliant uncirculated uh, uh, silver eagle that's at least 17 years old. So when I look at this and I look at these in the nationally advertised catalog. I have a 1921, which is what this one is, and you can get uh, either 1921, 19, 1900, 1901, 2, 3, or 4, mm -hmm. or 1921. The 1921 is $110 for just the Morgan silver dollar. That's the lowest price that they have in here. And then if you look at the Peace silver dollar, the lowest price they have got on a Peace silver dollar in uncirculated uh, uh, condition is $117. Okay, but you realize each coin is $56.65. $56 a coin. So instead of $110 or $117 right here. So that's almost uh, a 50% uh, uh, savings. That's pretty much right. Now this one, like I said, an early year brilliant uncirculated uh, uh, American Silver Eagle at $54. That, that's about a right price for that one. But you're going to go ahead and save $100 on the top two coins. Plus we, go, of course, have free shipping and handling for this. Right. So you've got this opportunity. Now these are not reprinted, restruck, or redone in any way, shape, or form. So look at these coins. I want to I get in here and, and I want you to look at this. Those, I, I know they look like they were made yesterday. Look at that pinwheel effect. That, well, that is, <clears throat> that's how we know that they have got original United States mint luster. United States mint luster, okay? Because it has been just like it was made almost 100 years ago. Just like it was made almost 100 years ago. When I rotate that, the reason I'm doing that is when a coin is struck, <clears throat> as the silver fills the voids of the die, it creates, the silver kind of flows into those voids, and it creates what's called a flow line. And those flow lines reflect light in a very specific way, and that way is called luster. And so, and it looks like the spokes of a wheel. That's why I keep turning these like this, okay? So that you can see that these are originally lustrous, brilliant, uncirculated United States government-issued coins. So you're going to get a Morgan dollar, a Peace dollar, and an American Silver Eagle 
Eagle from the 20th century in this. Now, one of the things about that American Silver Eagle, sure, I can sell you a 2017 or 16 or 15 or 14 for probably about $49.95. But you have to understand, prior to 2008, the United States government didn't make as many American Silver Eagles. As a matter of fact, they made so few of them, they're as much as 5 to 10 to 15 times rarer now or then than they are today. That's why getting the older American Silver Eagle is such a big deal when you're, when you're looking at this. The Morgan Silver Dollar is kind of self-explanatory in why it's worth $110 and this is 117 So you're like $225 for these two coins. So it's like saving 60 bucks and then and getting a free, getting... basically 20-year-old American Silver Eagle, right. still in original, brilliant, uncirculated condition. Now remember, each coin is in its own individual airtight holder. So what that means is, is you can pop these things out right here and you can present and display them without risk of damaging the coin. Or you can give look, it as a gift you if you wanted to break them You could give it as a gift individually, that's right, that one's 1922. The peace dollar is, like I said, one of the most famous and popular coins ever made by the United States Mint. I absolutely love these. They're starting to go very, very quickly. With only about a minute left, uh, uh, the phones are extremely busy on this set. I would suggest, once again, as always... Pull the Morgan out, because I, like the, the Morgan. Morgan I yeah. like the Morgan out. Yeah, the Morgans are always pretty uh, uh, pretty special. I, love I have them. been known to buy my husband Morgans uh -huh. for Christmas. Yes, Maybe absolutely. because I like them and I'm a little bit selfish and get what well, I like. Look at that. Yeah, absolutely. I <laughs> get that. Look at those. They're absolutely special. Stunning. You always call them the wild, wild west, right? Yeah, the, the cartwheels of the old west right. is what you've got here. And those are absolutely stunning, beautiful, brilliant, uncirculated coins for basically 50 bucks a piece. By the time you count in, uh, you know, the box and everything mm -hmm. else, I think you can easily call these and the 50, holders. Yeah, that's right, $50 a coin for coins that literally, coin by coin, if purchased individually, are 100 bucks. Plus, then you have the silver eagle. Plus, they're all silver as well. So you get the better part of three ounces of silver. It wasn't that long ago that these almost melted for $169.95. So great opportunity for you uh, uh, for on that set right there. That's right. So free shipping and you have four flexible payments of $42.49 to get these at home. Continue to call in 570-939 on that set of three coins. We also want to share with you two dozen left of our 2017 Ozark Riverways five ounce silver bullion coin. This is $219.95. We've got free shipping and handling. Once you spend $75, everything is going to be on free shipping after that. But Mike, you said on the Ozarks Riverway, that had a low mintage of only 20,000, right? That were ever made? Yes? Yes, no? 20,000. <laughs> okay. That makes it as rare as the Hawaii's, which we just sold out at $529. Okay. So now this one is just as rare, five ounces of pure silver, the final two dozen that I have got at 219. I did originally 189. I said, look, once we sell these out, the price is going up. Okay. Okay, that happened. Right. Once I sell these out, the next batch I get in, the price is going up, go up. Probably to 249 is my guess. Because it only 20,000. That makes it one of the single rarest coins ever made by the United States government, and certainly in this year. So final call out on that, two dozen now remaining. And I anticipate they probably will completely sell out. So if you'd like yours, mm -hmm. head your make your way to your laptop, your computer to get your order in, or mm -hmm. you can call that toll-free number at the bottom of the screen. But we're gonna move into our Silver Eagle complete mint set. This is from 2017. These are Mint State 70s. I love this set because you get all three. You get Philadelphia Mint, you get the San Francisco Mint, and you get the West Point Mint. Plus, let me just show you a little surprise. Yes. You're also going to get the Red Oak presentation box. So that's going to come included. You have a spot right for all three. You pop them in there. You can close it. You can leave it open. But this, what is the value on this alone, Mike? Uh, I think it's $29.95. Yeah, $24.95, okay. $29.95. Basically makes a set three that's right. So that comes included as well. Free shipping and handling to get this at home. This is the perfect way to commemorate 2017 for anything you may be celebrating. One thing, Mike, when you read the reviews on this on hsn.com, they're phenomenal. It's a customer pick. Well, and let me explain to you one. We, we did, I discussed this earlier when we did the kind of the supplemental mix. Yes. What the United States government did is they kind of threw us a curveball. And this set is very emblematic of that. Okay. In fact, what I want to do is I want to take this and I want to put this right out front so that we can kind of see that. Sorry, guys, I know I'm probably messing up everything about this. But I really think that the Red Oak presentation box is important, okay? 
The United States Mint, in 2011, 12, 13, and 14, we sold so many Silver Eagles that they needed help. The West Point Mint needed help from the San Francisco Mint, which they got, called the Supplemental Minted Coins. They were made at San Francisco without San Francisco Mint marks, but they marked the boxes, okay, so that you could then certify the coins and say, hey, they come from San Francisco. They did that 11, 12, 13, and 14. They said they stopped doing that in 2015. But, you know, something about it, uh, it, you know, when we started looking at the coins and grading the coins, the coins look different. So, in other words, if you look at this West Point Minute coin down here on the end, and if you look at these two other coins, they look subtly different. And those of us that do coins for a living, I mean, we, we, you know, we can differentiate coins like we can tell, you know, if we have twins, we can tell twins apart. I mean, we <laughs> know everything about these coins, and the coins just look differently. And we kept asking them in. So did you, no, 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 they're all, everything's made at West Point Mint. And then some intrepid numismatic journalist, I also did not know such a person existed, <laughs> filed a Freedom of Inf Information Act request with the United States Mint, the United Department of the Treasury. And by law, they have to answer that. They have to answer that right. And they said, by the way, could I have the number of silver eagles struck 2014, 15, 16, and 17 by the United States Mint at West Point, Philadelphia, and San Francisco? They said, you certainly can. And he says, also request serial numbers. So they said, yes, here it is, and here it's are the serial cool. numbers of the boxes that we'd made. And lo and behold, they had been secretly making silver eagles at the Philadelphia Mint the San Francisco Mint since 2015. They were holding out on us. They were holding out on us. And, and to this day, they said, well, it doesn't matter where they come from. All eagles are homogeneous, is the word they use. <laughs> well, I'm here to tell you it matters no, very much where they say. come from. So they made these secret silver eagles is ultimately what it comes down to. Here's the 2017s, the complete set in 70. Now, just for, uh, uh, not for nothing, if we go to hsn.com, I have the 2015 p minted coin, the first of the secret silver eagles in Mint State 70. 2015 P in Mint State 70. And you'll see what we're talking about in terms of rarity. Because here's what happened. Since we didn't know they were making them, and the only way you can get these supplemental, that's, that's the one right there. Yeah, that's the one. $4,599 in 70 for the 2015. That's the, that's the first of the secret bits. Wow. The 2016s, I have a couple of 70 sets left at $1,000 for the 2016. I may show those here in just a minute. So those secret coins, those the missing secret coins. coins. Yeah, yeah, the missing yeah. coins are a big deal. So now I have the 2017s right here. Now here's the great part of these in Min State 70 in the Red Oak presentation box. So you have these, and you have to understand, so the rarest American silver eagle, Min State silver eagle, is that 2015p that we just saw for 4500 bucks. You know what the next rarest Mint State American Silver Eagle is? No. This coin right here. Oh. So you go from 4500 to basically $139. Wow. If you count this here. There are 100 I sell the regular West Point minted coin right here for $139. Now you have two of the five rarest Silver Eagles ever made, including the second rarest. So that's the San for Francisco the Mint. The San Francisco Mint, is, this is the fourth rarest. This is the second rarest and the fourth rarest. The rarest is 4,600. Then you have this one. Then you have basically this one. So you have rarity at an absolutely positively unprecedented uh, uh, scale. There are only 2,017 of these first day issue sets that we are able to do, as you can see, at $429.95. I have 681 of them remaining. So this is that first day of issue that we were able to do because we know from the serial numbers on the boxes. So what you have got here is a unique set. Two of the coins that the United States government never wanted you to know about, that we did not literally know about until March of this year. Now, when I'm talking about the rarity of this being the second rarest coin, I'm talking about by mintage. I'm talking about by mintage for this particular coin. If you look in actuality, okay, if you look in actuality, it's even rarer than that because the vast majority of them were made once the box gets opened up. Right. Once the box Didn't gets we have opened the box up. Too, yeah, if we can, if we can look at that big box. green box. Once <laughs> that tape is open, if it's not done at the grading company, those are lost forever. They become de facto West Point minted American silver eagles. They become de facto West Point minted American silver eagles. And that's what the issue is, and that's the collectability. And so while functionally, 
They made a million of these, which makes it 40 times rarer than this coin. And they made a million of these, which makes it 40 times rarer than this coin. The actual number is less than 100,000. So it puts it on the same par with that 1995 W American Silver Eagle, which, like I said, in this condition is $29,000. So when you look at the three rarest American Silver Eagles in order, mm -hmm. you have got the 1995 W, which in this condition we sell for $30,000. <laughs> then oh you have gosh. the 2015 Philadelphia Mint, which we sell for $4,599, right. and we've sold lots of them. Yep. And then you have this coin. And I'm literally selling you this coin for, for what amounts to the same exact price as I would sell you a regular Silver Eagle that's not one of the secret American Silver Eagles. It is absolutely stunning that you can still get this coin, and I've still got a small quantity of these available of, uh, 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 given the phenomenal rarity of this particular coin. If you take this on any other level, let's say a 1996 American Silver Eagle, mm -hmm which they made five, six, seven, eight times as many in this condition. It would be literally thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars. That was the rarest Mint State Eagle till these came out. Wow. Okay? And those are thousands of dollars in Mint State 70. If you look at the 1986, the 1986, which is 10 times, this coin's 10 times rarer than the 1986. In Mint State 70, we're looking at $499, $599. It's right. absolutely <laughs> stunning, the rarity of this set that so, I can sell you for literally at $139.95. That's right. So don't forget, you get all three coins, $429.95, free shipping, $559.136. It is a customer pick on hsn.com. You get the Philadelphia Mint, the San Francisco Mint, and the West Point Mint. So continue to call in there. But as we move right along, we want to share with you, this is the 2017 Mint State 69 set, and you're going to get all three. So we just shared with you. The it's 70s. the same coin. These oh, are the no, 69s. These are the 69s. Okay. okay. Now, now this is a special opportunity. So this shows you the difference in the grade. In the difference in the grade. Right. Notice we also did a price, price break, break on this. Price break and free shipping. I, I really wanted to get this to 199. Because there's a lot of people, because you have to buy these supplemental minute coins that I was talking about. They have to be certified. Just by definition, okay, the Philadelphia and San Francisco minted coins have to be certified. They don't have a mint mark. The only way we can know is matching up the serial numbers to that letter that the United States uh, uh, Mint put out with the Freedom of Information Act request. They gave the serial number, so you have to get the box, and then it has to match can up the serial number. Can we get the box number. back out, Allison, yeah. if that's okay? Uh, yeah, and, and, and it has to match up the serial number Okay, and when you do that, then you can certify the coins, and only then can you certify the coins. Yes. Yeah. And so Thanks. what you have now is absolute and complete rarity. This is still the second rarest American Silver Eagle ever made by the United States government. Now, here's right. the key. Okay. You're basically getting these for $69, not even $69, 50, right. $63 a coin. And still desirable at Mint State 69. All certified at Mint State 69 because it's the only way that you can own them. Let me see, here's okay. what the box looks like, okay? So this box, the United States government does not sell these directly to the United States public. So this box comes that you see right here. This contains 500 American Silver Eagles when it's directly made from the Mint. You get that from an authorized purchaser. There's a band on this box, okay, okay, that shows that it's sealed, okay, and it's sealed at the mint. This box, of course, once it has been opened, then the coins in there are de facto West Point Mint coins because there's no mint marks. Unless it's opened up at the It has party. to be opened, and you have to match the serial number with the, with the letter from the mint, and then there is a secondary serial number uh, uh, that's inside the box. So that has to match up. That's why it has to so be opened. So that double at, authentication. That's right. That's why it has to be opened up at the uh, grading service so that they can guarantee that that matches up. Then and only then, I'm going to put this back okay. here then and only then can you put in these coins uh, and can you put them in holders now I will sell you basically just about any United States mint silver eagle just about any United States mint silver eagle is going to be at least $69.95. As a matter of fact I think I do an auto ship on these at $99.95. Right. 
But we are here at $66 a coin, and we are including for you the second and fourth rarest, the second and fourth rarest United States government issue mint state silver eagles is what we're looking at within this set for basically that same $66 that I would sell right. you just any regular American silver eagle. And because these are the secret ones, you are getting them on price break. So typically you would not see them on price break, but Mike really wanted to be able to do the $199.95. So you're now going to save that additional $20. We are also going to save on the free shipping and handling. So that's another, I think, $5 or whatever that may be. Plus, with that $5 savings on the shipping and handling, you still have that 30-day money-back guarantee. And we also have four flexible payments of $49.99 on any major credit card to be able to get this at home. And unless these are authenticated and graded at any of the four major grading companies, then there, you really do not know what mint they came from. That's right. And the fact is, is to be able to get these secret silver eagles. And so let me go through this if you're just tuning in. Okay. These are secret. Literally until March 22nd of this year, we did not even know these coins existed mm -hmm. in any way, shape, or form. As a matter of fact, the United States Mint, the vast majority of these have been lost forever to collectors because the boxes have been opened without anybody knowing what was going on. What we did is we had uh, a gentleman, like I said, an intrepid numismatic journalist, once again, I also had no idea they existed, who asked the United States Treasury, the Department of the Treasury, could I please get the mintage figures for American Silver Eagles from 2014, 15, 16, and 17 from Philadelphia, West Point, and San Francisco? And the Mint said, you most certainly can because they have to uh, honor a Freedom of Information Act request. Please, could you also provide the serial numbers, of which he did as well. Right. So we found out, March 22nd of this year, that the United States government has secretly been making American Silver Eagles at, in 2015, 16, and 17 at both the Philadelphia and San Francisco Mint. We tried to ask the Mint why they did that, and they kind of refused to answer. I have no idea why it's such a big deal. They've kept it secret. I have no idea why they've kept it secret. We have, we have no idea. All we know is that the entire landscape of American silver eagle collecting has been changed forever. We have now added coins in a rarity that has never before been available. In other words, we have coins that the rarest American silver eagle prior to March 22nd of this year, Mint State American silver eagle, was the 1996 American silver eagle, which in Mint State 69, I could not sell you for $199. Mm -hmm. After March 22nd, all of a sudden there were five coins rarer. Okay? All of a sudden, there were five coins rarer. And these coins are two of them. And not at over $199 a piece, but $199 for the. Remember, you get all three coins. You have to understand it's a complete set because it contains both a Philadelphia minted, a San Francisco minted, and a West Point minted coin. More importantly, these coins are what are called supplemental minted coins. They don't actually have a mint mark on them. They must be differentiated out of their original mint boxes. So they came in these 500 coin boxes that the Mint does not sell to the general public. Now the vast majority of those opened up. Okay, the vast majority of those are opened up. And so what happens Sorry. is, we'll get those here in a second. And uh, once again, that's one of the great things about Robin's not allowed to touch the I box anymore. Got my goodness, yes. we are really clumsy tonight. Yes. We, Do you like how I included you in there? Yes, thank you very much. You're well, I did knock over a fair number of coins yes, earlier. Yes, yes. And holy, so what holy. happens is, is the United States government has now all of a sudden started talking about these secret American silver eagles. Now, right. after the fact, and I don't know why or where or how or for what reason, they've in essence tried to cover this up. In other words, saying by, it's saying it's not important. Right. They go, it doesn't matter what mint they come from. It does when this one's 40 times rarer than this one. It does when this one is 40 times rarer than this one. So where they come from is of significance and incredible importance from a collectible standpoint. There's absolutely no doubt about it. You get those three coins for basically the price as regular coins. You get two of the rarest American silver eagles ever made, including two, number two, and number four. And like I said, number one in this condition, five ninety nine. dollars Oh my gosh. And you're getting it on price break. So you're getting that $20 off, free shipping and four flex. It's 559-625 is your item number. All three coming included. Now, well over 600 of you have picked up the enhanced uncirculated Perfect 70, so the highest possible grade, first day of issue, limited edition of 936. Wow. But we've already sold over 600, Mike, so that's more than half the collection. 
That's two thirds of the collection. Yeah, two thirds. We are two thirds sold out. Now understand, this is the brand new enhanced uncirculated set. These are the sets that were released at the Denver ANA. These were the ones that were released at the Denver ANA with the special Denver ANA stands for American Numismatic Association label that are exclusive to us. 936 in the limited edition. Two thirds sold out. Two thirds sold out. Absolutely, positively phenomenal opportunity for you. Now we're going to spend a, a, we're going to spend a minute here. Okay. Now this okay. is the satin uh, finish, right? This is satin. Is finish. this what you call the fall between the cracks? This coin? is the fall between oh. the cracks. Coin. I've not had this coin, and you can see this is about a four point. What is it? 4.9 star? It is a 4.8 out of 10 reviews, 8, nine perfect five star reviews on hsn.com. I want to spend a little bit of time here because I am down to my final quantities of these that I can do. And we've done flex pay, free shipping. Right. I don't think we've ever done that before. No, and normally you get like one or the other, not to be able to get free shipping and four flex. I mean, 37.49 to get the highest possible grade, pure silver. Mike, walk us through the importance of this. Well, here's finish. what it comes down to. This is last year's coin, okay? This is the 2016 W satin finish. The United States government made these three different silver eagles last year. They made a min state coin, a proof coin, and a satin finish coin. Of those three coins, this is the rarest of those coins. Yeah. It also so happened last year that it was the 30th anniversary of the United States Mint. In the past, for the 10th anniversary, we're very familiar with that coin, the 10th anniversary American Silver Eagle, the 1995 W. That coin, last time we sold it, I don't know, I think uh, I sold one here. You mean oh, the 30th anniversary, the 10th of, the anniversary. Oh, no, the of the Silver Eagle? Oh, of the Silver Eagle. Of the Silver Eagle. Oh, okay. I thought you said the The 10th anniversary uh, set of the American okay. Silver Eagle. We sold that coin that came out of that set for $30,000. Wow. Okay. Wow. Then they did a 20th anniversary set right. that they did 225, 250,000 coins. We sell that coin. And understand, these are not distinguishable other than the label on the coin itself, okay? Other than the label on the coin itself. They are not distinguishable from the regular American Silver Eagle. And we sell that coin for about $800 to $1,000. Then they did the 25th anniversary, same thing, just to, and it was a reverse proof coin. Once again, uh, is all that was. They made 100000 of that coin, and we sell that coin for twelve dollars to $1,500, okay? So, look at this. This coin is, of all of those anniversary coins, there is only the, two th only the 30th anniversary is marked on the coin itself that is part of the anniversary series, okay? And it says 30th anniversary on the coin itself. It is within that, that remember that 20th anniversary I was telling you about, that's $1,100, this yeah. coin is rarer. Mm -hmm. This coin is rare. So it is the rarest satin finish coin that the United States government has ever made. It is the only satin finish coin, as a matter of fact, the only Silver Eagles ever marked with any anniversary designation on the coin itself is 30th anniversary. We have this coin in SP70, and I have got it at my original issue price. And I have got this at my original issue price that you see right here at $149. This is, an, this is why I call this the fall between the cracks That's coin. Right. Because what happened is, is traditionally this coin, like the, the Silver Eagle, the satin finish coin from this year has already been released. In 2016, the Mint was tied up with other business, it seemed, because they did not release this coin until very late in 2016. As a matter of fact, I never even got an opportunity to sell this coin in 2016. Really? We already had moved to 2017 before we had this. And what we end up with is one of the great American Silver Eagle rarities that many, many, many collectors have absolutely, positively no idea even exists. Okay, have no idea it even exists. This special 30th anniversary, the rarest satin finish, the rarest uh, of the 30th anniversary, is the rarest of the anniversary coins, of course, other than the 95W, which is a $25,000 uh, to $30,000 coin. So here's what your options are for special American Silver Eagles in terms of price. $30,000, $1,100, $1,500, or $149.95. I think I know how I can with, choose. That's right. With a red oak presentation. Box. Right. And therein lies the rub. And therein is why I have my final quantities from the 2016 certified absolutely positively perfect. Now, I know the clock is starting to run down. We may give you a little extra time on this because the quantities on these are particularly and phenomenally limited. This is one of my favorite coins. People always ask me, what coin should I collect? And I point them oft, oftentimes to this particular coin because... 
of the special anniversary of American Silver Eagles, which the American government has, the United States Mint has made for many years, there is only the 30th anniversary coins that are, that are marked on the edge. And, and within this, they have only made the satin finish coins for 10 years. This is the 10th anniversary of the satin finish coin as well. So it celebrates two. So it celebrates two anniversaries right. with this. Of all of the satin finish coins, this is the rarest. So not only do you have the rarity of the of the special anniversary coin, and the only one of the anniversary, there's four anniversary American Silver Eagles basically. This is the only one, the 30th anniversary, that I can sell you for less than a thousand dollars. Because I still have the original quantity. As a matter of fact, I purchased almost 20% of the entire quantity of this because I knew that this was going to be one of the absolute top total and most significant coins right. put out by the United States Mint. I knew it was overlooked. They right. didn't, they only made it to order. Wow. So what happens is, is as the United States government stopped taking orders on these, they basically stopped making them. And the rarity of this coin all of a sudden, out of nowhere, becomes almost legendary. It came becomes out of like almost, left field. That's right. And right. that's why I'm saying it's the fall between the cracks that's coin. Point. So this is a last year coin. But I've still got last year's price, even into right. 2017 because well, I bought so many and I anticipated the design. That's right. And one of the things that you should really remember is Mike talking about the fact that well, we kept it at the same price. So at $149.95, the price did not go up. We're holding that price here. Plus, we're also offering free shipping. So in the combination of both, along with four flexible payments, you're getting it at home for $37.49 on four monthly installments on your credit card. We're including the red oak presentation box as well. But with that satin finish, with the the fact it's commemorating the 30th anniversary of the Silver Eagle it just makes it so collectible and sought after. And I know we had a clock there, but here's what's happening, because this is the first time I've been able to offer this in several months. Okay. It is my final quantities. I want to spend a little extra time here, if, if, if that's okay. I have to ask permission, if we can, because of the Mike significance. Mike following the rules? <laughs> Mike follows what? the rules most of the time. Even the crew went, what? <laughs> Even uh, you know, I, 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 well, I get crazy about coins. You're you know, passionate. I, I'm very passionate, passionate about the coins. And so people ask me, what coins do you really like? And I'm going, this coin. Coin, okay. Because when you look at the hallmarks of collectability, those things that make a coin ultimately and totally and phenomenally collectible, this coin hits all the marks, okay? It checks all the boxes. Mm -hmm. It hits all the bases. I don't know how many more of those I can go through. But, but that's ultimately what it is because you have the type of coin that it is, the SP or satin finish. They've only been making that since 2006. Of all of the satin finish coins, this is the rarest. Okay. How if, many have they made of the satin uh, the ten, finish? There's been nine satin finish, eight satin finish okay. coins that have been made. Okay. This is the rarest of all the satin finish coins. It was released at the end of the year, so they didn't make very many of them, making it the rarest of the satin finish. But on top of that, it has this additional designator of being designated right on the coin itself by the United States Mint 30th anniversary. Now understand. You have a 10th anniversary coin in this condition at 30 grand. No place on the coin does it say 10th anniversary. It just says it on the holder. It just came out of the set. The 20th anniversary coin, no place on the coin does it say 20th anniversary. So this is but the it, first time. That's right. But in, on the, in, the, in that set coin, $1,100 we sell it for. This coin's rarer than that $1,100 coin. Same grade. And at one forty nine ninety five. That's right. So this is the fourth. <laughs> yes, I'm getting excited. Well, because I, you know, people say, "What coins you excite, get excited about?" I go, "Wow, about this one." This one. Okay, this, this one. one. This one right here. And the reason behind this is once again rarity, absolutely there. Uniqueness, 100% there with the 30th anniversary mm -hmm. stamping on the side. The other thing is, is you keep in mind it's last year's coin. Okay. And we still have it this year. What was my original issue price? $149.95. Now, to my knowledge, I don't think I have ever done this coin at free shipping and handling. Right, right. Now, here's the thing. And Given the flex. fact that it's rarer, more desirable, more collectible, and it's one of those incredible once-in-a-lifetime coins, to hold the price, you'd think I would, let's say, take Maybe away take the... Yeah, take out. that back. Maybe because that's, fast. that's a $14.95 box. Really We're still going to pretty. give you the Red Oak presentation box at $14.95. What this gives you is the opportunity, because if you look at the regular American Silver Eagle from 2017, which they're going to make about, or 2016, which I think they made 40 million coins. They made 40 million of those coins. Mm -hmm. 
That coin I sell you with a Red Oak presentation box for about $129. Wow. This coin is almost, almost 200 times rarer. Not, not 100, 200 <laughs> times rarer than the 2016 West Point Minute Silver And Mike, that's why everybody's jumping in. That's and we right, and a very big weight now in the phones as well, yes. you would expect, yeah. And you know, because Mike was talking about just not only the rarity, the collectability, the fact that we still have it at the same price, and the fact we have free shipping, we're adding that in, the four flexible payments of $37.49 to be able to get this at home. We're also including that red oak presentation box. This is the coin, Mike, the passion the excitement, the enthusiasm. We can see this is one of great importance. Well, if you look, we got 150 coins sold right, right now. I have at least that many people on the phone. Once again, uh, it's a, a last year right. coin at a last year price. And like I said, I don't know that I've ever done free shipping. So that uh, makes it a critical. So once again, let's, I got about a minute and a half or so here. Yes. Suddenly. Let me go over it again. There are four anniversary American Silver Eagles, 10th anniversary, 20th, 25th, and 30th. In order of price, 20,000. 1100 1500 or 149 Okay? <laughs> I so you can got figure that. that out, Mike. Satin finish eagles. The rare satin finish eagle right here. The rare swiss all, all the things right here. All the designating factors. Boom. So Perfect. we want to share with you 538906 on your item number for that coin. Oh, Mike. Mike, Mike, Mike. Mike, this, Mike, Mike, uh, Mike, Mike, Mike. <laughs> This has been so popular. Brand new launch today. Share with us quickly some highlights. Over 600 sold. This is the brand new enhanced uncirculated set. It is the set that was sold at the the Denver ANA show, making it one of only 25,000. There's only 936 exclusive dust, certified perfect in the Red Oak presentation box. Nicely done. $349.95, free shipping to get it at home. Uh, 577-371. We also want to share with you hsn.com. Check out all of the coins that we have available there for you. Some are so rare, so limited, we don't even have time for full presentations on hsn.com. You can even check out all kinds of new arrivals. The latest for all coin collectors, whether you're just starting out or or maybe you're that expert coin collector like Mike himself. So we'd love for you to continue to shop there. Mike, thank you so much. Uh, you will see if you'd like to tune in at 2 a.m. and you missed any.